It was the night before Christmas when all through the house not a creature was stirring, not even a mouse. Mouse. Very good. The stockings were hung by the chimney with care in hopes that St. Nicholas soon, soon would be, be there. there. Yeah, just jump oh. in at a time, people. We're like a small group oh, today. Right on me. The children were nestled all <laughs> snug in their beds while visions of sugar plums danced in their heads. And Mama in her kerchief and I in my cap had just settled down for a long winter's nap. When out on the lawn there arose such a clatter, I sprang from my bed to see what was the matter. Away to the window I flew like a flash, very good, tore open the shutter, then threw up the sash. The moon on the breast of the new fallen snow gave the luster of midday to objects below. When what to my wondering eye should appear but a miniature sleigh and eight tiny reindeer. With a little old driver so lively and quick, I knew in a moment it must be St. Nick. More rapid than eagles, his horses they came, and he whistled and shouted and called them by name. Do you know me? Now Dancer, now Dancer, now Prancer and Dixon, on Tommy, on Cupid, on Donner and Blitzen. To the top of the porch, to, to the, the top, top of the wall, wall. Now, now dash away, dash away, dash away all. Oh. There she goes, dashing away. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you know what? Rudolph's not in this story. <laughs> He's in the next story. <laughs> Didn't make As it. dry leaves that before the wild hurricane fly, when they met with an obstacle, mount to the sky. So up to the house up the coursers they flew, with a sleigh full of toys and St. Nicholas too. And then, in a twinkling, I heard on the roof the prancing and coin of each little poop. As I drew in my head and was turning around, down the chimney St. Nicholas came with a bound. He was dressed all in fur from his head to his foot, and his clothes were all tarnished with ashes and soot. A bundle of toys he had flung on his back, and he looked like a peddler just opening his pack. He come back, little girl. Mm -hmm. His eyes, how they twinkled. His dimples, Mom how merry. His ending. cheeks were like roses. His nose like I a got cherry. cherry. Oh, his no, tall little no. mouth was drawn up like a bow, and the beard of his chin oh, was as oh, white as the snow. Yeah. The stump of a pipe he held tight in his teeth, and the smoke it encircled his head like a wreath. He had a broad face and a little round belly that shook when he laughed like a bowl full of jelly. He was chubby and plump, a right jolly old elf, and I laughed when I saw him in spite of myself. A wink of his eye and a twist of his head soon gave me to know I had nothing to dread. He spoke not a word, but went straight to his work. He filled all the stockings and turned with, with a, a jerk. jerk. And laying a finger aside of his nose and giving it.